fight to fix schools in East Greenwich already coming on over budget. Town councilors and other officials spent hours tonight laying out their options for the road ahead. Kayla Fish was at that meeting and joins us with the latest. Kayla. Well, guys, this isn't the first town or city to run into rising costs. In fact, we told you about the increasing costs to build new schools in Warwick just last week. Here in East Greenwich, officials say that they're taking a proactive approach, working to make sure that the school renovations approved by voters get done in some way that's still affordable to residents. Now, a special town council meeting here in East Greenwich focused on those school improvement projects lasted about three hours tonight. Around this time last year, in November of 2023, voters approved a $150 million bond to fix five schools in town, including elementary schools and the high school. But the costs for the project already appear to be ballooning higher, with some estimates pegging the costs at about $172 million. That's a nearly $25 million increase, and final figures have yet to be ironed out. Councilors, town finance experts, and members of the project management team spent hours tonight discussing options for additional funding, including a bond premium and using leftover money from previous school bonds and looking at the potential impact to taxpayers. We're going to ultimately have to reduce overall scope of work, probably increased available revenues beyond the $150 million to find a place that the project delivers on the educational requirements and vision, but also is affordable to community members. Now, nothing was decided tonight. The school building and construction committees will work over the next month to revise the scope of the plan and make it fiscally responsible. From there, it will have to be approved by both the school committee and the town council. In East Greenwich, I'm Kayla Fish, 12 News.